Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. I've been posting some videos over the last month or so regarding the tabs for Windows 11's File Explorer that has been coming and going a little bit in some dev channel builds as a hidden feature in the Windows 11 Insider program. And up until recently, Microsoft has yet to officially confirm or announce the tab support for Windows 11's File Explorer. Now, um, yesterday on the 5th of April 2022 at Microsoft's Hybrid event, they have now officially announced and confirmed a couple of new changes and features coming to the File Explorer uh, for Windows 11 in the future. And the main one here is that Windows 11's File Explorer will be getting tab support. Now, before we dive into the tab support, there are a couple of other new features and changes coming to the File Explorer in Windows 11 just uh, worth mentioning quickly for you in this video in case you're interested. And some of those will be that the File Explorer is getting a new home page with a new favorites option. And also the File Explorer will be getting Microsoft 365 Cloud support, which means if you are subscribed to Microsoft 365 uh, in the future, that means you could be getting file suggestions from your 365 account, which would make it a whole lot easier to find what you're looking for because all your files um, you will see and will get in one place um, in the File Explorer uh, instead of having to go between the different services to access your data and your files, which I think is a nice move in the right direction. Now, uh, regarding the uh, tabs in the File Explorer, as mentioned, just to update you quickly, um, this was just a GIF taken from my last video, which was a screenshot um, from uh, one of the dev channel builds of the tab support in the File Explorer. And at the Harvard event yesterday on the uh, 5th, uh, Microsoft has said now that they are enabling tabs uh, in the File Explorer in, the inter in their internal builds, and then which means that um, in the near future, that will roll out to the Windows 11 Insider program for testing. Um, and, and then and because of that, there's a good chance that this will be rolling out uh, to the general public sometime later on this year. Now, just to do a quick recap, in case um, you were unaware, as we can see, the tabs appear at the top of the File Explorer, just like your conventional web browsers, where you can open uh, different windows uh, in one window, like your web browser and your, um, your File Explorer. And you can create new tabs. You can drag and drop, as we can see in this uh, GIF. And then also, now, according to reports, um, when you right click on a file, you will have the option to choose between opening that file in a new tab or in a new window. So that will just give you some options there, opening a file in a new window or a new tab. Now, um, apparently, according to reports as well, uh, the tabs in the Windows 11's File Explorer will be enabled by default. But at this stage, it's not known if Microsoft will actually give us an option to disable the tab support. So at this stage, it's a default feature and it's not clear if uh, there will be an option to disable the feature. Now, just to mention some other um, highlights that Microsoft did announce at their hybrid event yesterday on the 5th that will be rolling out to Windows 11 in the future. Um, apparently, there are new features uh, for InFocus where um, Microsoft is now including an integrated focus timer and a do not disturb feature to track and personalize your focus time. And also um, regarding the snap layouts for touchscreen enabled devices, they are also adding uh, touch uh, snap layouts now for touch enabled devices. And there's also um, an accessibility, a new accessibility feature coming where there's a new live captions feature which can add captions um, from audio uh, and all the apps across and what you are using in the Windows 11 operating system as a new accessibility feature. Now, according to Microsoft at this stage, um, they haven't confirmed and they are saying that um, at this stage, some of these features might roll out as individual updates or they could possibly roll out um, in the uh, Windows 11 22H2 Sun Valley 2 feature update rolling out later on this year. So, um, we are definitely getting File Explorer, the tab support in the File Explorer, and all these other new features will be rolling out. But at this stage, they could be rolling out um, as individual updates through the course of the year. But if they don't um, roll out as updates, 
um, they will be rolling out as new features in Windows 11 version 22H2 in the latter half of this year. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.